Hey guys, Big Jonas here. We're checking in on Bitcoin's current four hour chart here. We are getting close to potentially a triple tap here of our rising support line. We initially touched it around 4040 here on the Coinbase USD chart. We had found support at 4090 with a higher low. And right now we're trying to put in another higher low as we're losing again our momentum here. We keep getting rejected by this resistance line of our angle here. Now, our volume has been pretty light to moderate ever since we had bottomed currently on November 20th. We can see here we're slowly beginning to rise on our bear volume here. We're on a four-hour chart here. We're on our fourth four-hour candle in a row here. And uh, this will finish up in about 10 minutes here. We're going to basically be starting our last four-hour candle of the day. And we're going to see if we can hold our equilibrium here and hold our uh, apex when we get closer to it on our triangle here. Uh, because what's going to happen here is there's going to be an area where we're going to see a movement or a conviction change, either continuing down here, following and breaking through our lower Bollinger, or actually trying to find support on it by holding that higher low and then being able to range higher because what's happening here is a lot of our indicators like our RSI and our stochastics have been able to move up ever so slightly as they've been trying to build a little bit momentum as we've been going sideways here. But it's been pretty weak and lackluster here. We kind of see that, especially with our OBV, you know, losing that follow through and just barely holding that higher low right there too. And our chalk and money flow, again, we were able to get some money in this buying area back at the market here, but we've given away a lot of that, especially with this double top here, we can clearly see. So the four hour chart, we're gonna keep an eye on this as well as our daily chart, we get closer to it and see how we can close this day out here and try and see if we can change this bearish momentum because right now the bears clearly have control. We're still inside of our lower Bollinger and that could, another tap could take us down into the 3800 area if we break bearish and look for it once again as support where it acted that way yesterday. We still have about four hours left in our day here, and we definitely see our volume is decreasing while our bear volume continues to increase. Stay tuned. Keep you guys posted.